Jewelry? Seriously? Sheldon, you are the most shallow, self-centered person I have ever met. Do you really think that another transparently manip- Oh, it's a tiara! <laughs> Of course I do! I'm a princess and this is my tiara! <laughs> Ooh, Amy, looking sexy. You think they don't have mirrors in there? I know how I look. <laughs> Fair warning, we can get crazy. <laughs> I need some context. Pantsuits suck. And that opens her up to justifiable ridicule for wearing them. Good one, Bernadette. <laughs> See? Crazy. I kissed a girl and I liked it. What happened to you? And you want me to kill her? Done. <laughs> yes, dirty. Dirty, dirty, dirty. <laughs> Which brings me to our next order of business. Fascinating. <laughs> I hope you don't take what I'm about to do as a comment on what we just did. Morning, Amy. It most assuredly is not. Are you experiencing dehydration, headache, nausea, and shame? Yes. I also found a Korean man's business card tucked into my cleavage. What happened last night? Oh, memory impairment. The free prize at the bottom of every vodka bottle. Sheldon. All right. Last night, you gave me some excellent advice regarding my problem here at home. You kissed me and then vomited on and off for 40 minutes, <laughs> following which you passed out on your bathroom floor. I then folded a towel under your head as a pillow, set your oven clock to the correct time because it was driving me crazy, <laughs> and I left. Don't really know where we go from here. I suggest we treat our relationship as if it were a crashed computer and restore it to the last point we both agree it worked. Terrific. Thank you. They were out of menthols. Get off my back! Wouldn't you be more comfortable at home? <laughs> Not really, no. Alrighty then. So I'll just get started. Leonard, please, I don't need the running commentary. Should I go? I've been told sometimes I overstay my welcome. What? Well, who told you that? Well, most recently my gynecologist. Five, six, seven, eight. Tall and ten and young and lovely. The girl from me. Panima goes walking, and when she passes, each one she passes goes, Amy, Amy, Amy. Oh. Oh, look, it's Sheldon and little Leonard. Hi, little Leonard. Hi, Amy. Hey, Cuddles. Cuddles? Yes, Cuddles. We cuddled. Grow up, Leonard. Amy, what are you doing here? Well, I came here to get a bottle. 
like Penny taught me to do when you're sad. <laughs> yeah, but why didn't you go back to your apartment? Didn't you go to high school, Leonard? Parking lots are where all the cool kids hang out. <laughs> Not that the rat bastards ever invited me. Maybe we should get you home. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Sheldon, what would it take for you to go into that liquor store, buy a bottle of hooch, take me across the street to that motel and have your way with me? Yeah, Sheldon, what would it take? <laughs> I'm begging both of you, please, let's go. Oh. Come on. daisy Oh, finally someone found second base. <laughs> I'm a cowboy. <laughs> on a steel horse I ride. I'm wanted. I'm wanted. <laughs> Sheldon, you're ruining girlfriend boyfriend sing along night. I don't know. I think you might look sexy with long hair. Maybe the kind that flows down to your shoulders and blows back while riding on a horse. Bare back and bare chested. I'm gonna go brush my teeth. It might take a while. Sheldon and I engaged in sexual intercourse. In other news, I'm thinking of starting an herb garden. Mom's the word, gotta go. Bernadette just asked about my sexual encounter with you. The meme has reached full penetration. Oh, hey, Amy, Bernadette just texted me. Howard proposed? Yes, not important. Just stop by to let you know I'm getting orthotics. Also, I'm carrying Sheldon's baby. Mom's the word. Excuse me? Zach, I am Amy Farrah Fowler. We met the other night. I have spent my life in pursuit of pure knowledge. Until I met you, my decisions were founded in logic and reason. And yet here I stand before you, 130 pounds of raging estrogen, longing to grab hold of your gluteus maximus and make Shakespeare's metaphorical beast with two backs. My gluteus what? <laughs> On the other hand, as I look at the blank, ape-like expression on your face, I have decided to adopt the Vulcan practice of colonar. <laughs> Goodbye, Zach. Bye. <gasps> that should hold me for a while. Guten Tag, das YouTube. Ich bin ein Bavarian. Und ich bin eine Pretzel. Und this is Sheldon Cooper presents Fun Mint Flags. You want some coffee liqueur on your ice cream? Ah, here's the alcohol and drug peer pressure Mother warned me about. I was starting to think it was never going to happen. Yes, please. You guys should have seen Leonard when I first met him. I mean, there was no eye contact. He was either looking up at the ceiling or down at his shoes. I'm drunk. <laughs> well, well, well. Look who it is. Okay, be nice. Hello? Hey, we're just heading out for a drink. Because I do that now. <laughs> no, it's not. It's a strategic maneuver. Leonard's new girlfriend is testing Bernadette's loyalty to you and the group. That bitch is crafty. You think? Of course. How does the cheetah attack a herd of wildebeests? By going after its weakest member. Well, what makes me the weakest member? Your trusting nature coupled with your teeny tiny body. You wouldn't last a minute on the Serengeti. Oh, my metatarsals are barking. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm just breaking in some new shoes. Very pretty. Thank you. Did you know that women wear high heels to make the buttocks and breasts more prominent? I hadn't really thought about it. Look. Uh, 
sure. It's very it's prominent. Please, Leonard, don't leer. You have a girlfriend. Sorry. So are you off to dinner with Priya Howard and Bernadette? Yeah. How did you know? I heard it at the mall when I was shopping with my girlfriends, because, you know, that's kind of my life now. <laughs> have a good night. Try not to ogle my caboose as I walk away. <laughs> no, uh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I take it all back. Look, I'm, uh, I'm sitting in your chair. There's nothing wrong with it. It's a great chair. Please let me continue to be part of your world. <laughs> What's wrong? Oh, something in the chair is biting my tushy. It's not important. No. Oh, wait, get up, get up. At this moment, I find myself craving human intimacy and physical contact. Oh, boy. <laughs> you know ours is a relationship of the mind. Proposal. One wild night of torrid lovemaking that soothes my soul and inflames my loins. <laughs> Counter-proposal. I will gently stroke your head and repeat, ah, who's a good Amy? How about this? French kissing. Seven minutes in heaven culminating in second base. <laughs> Neck massage. <laughs> then you get me that beverage. We cuddle. Final offer. Very well. <laughs> oh, boy. I'm just saying second base is right there. <laughs>